Amen. Good morning, people of God. My name is Rose, originally from Limpopo. Uh, my baby's name is Torofato, meaning blessing. Can you put your hands together for Master Jesus? Amen and amen. Please tell us the wonderful works God have done for you. Uh, my testimony goes like this. Uh, I was having a problem of short breath. And one day I came here to the church, but it was not a service. And then I was outside. I was coming to buy the mediums because I was run out of the medium. So I was outside. When I'm outside, uh, Prophet was inside the church. I didn't come inside, but I was outside. And then when I was outside, Prophet came out from the church, come out from the church. And then he said to me, I see you, they attack you during the night. Uh, yes, I was, during the, from 5 p.m., I was cha challenged by the, I was having the problem of short breath from 5 p.m., but during the day I was fine. Every 5 p.m. I was having the problem. So prophet said to me, uh, uh, drink the living, the, drink live, the living, living, the living God. Yes, uh, he gave me the drink and live. He said to me, he gave me the drink and live. He said, you don't drink, but you wash your face every night when you go to sleep. It was 2018. And then I do that. I wash my face every night when I go to sleep. And then from that day, I used nothing. I sleep like a baby until today. Let us clap for Master Jesus. My second testimony, uh, during my pregnancy, I was having lots of attacks. Uh, I was four months, by that time, prophet, he said to me, it was through the Zoom, he said to me, go to Mesli, I was there by the, I was sitting there by the pregnant woman, he said, go to the Mesli land, I went to the Mesli land, when I come out, I fell by my bag, when I fell by my bag, uh, I didn't know what happened, and then, when I, when I come back to sit in my chair, a uh, prophet said to me that I see you, the doctor surrounding you, and then they do Caesar in you, and then they take out the baby, and then you, after that you die. Uh, he said to me, go to, it was anointing service by October, he said go to emergency line, to the prayer line. I went to the prayer line, and then he prayed for me. He said, go deliver your baby safely. There's no spirit of Caesar. And then anoint yourself and pray this prayer. Say that I'll give birth like an Hebrew woman. Amen. I'll never die. Amen. I'll born this baby normally. I'll never have a Caesar. Let Jesus. us clap for Master Jesus. Put your hands together for Master Jesus. And then, Sister, at what point in time did the doctors told you that you are going to have delivered through cesarean operation? Yes, because my baby was a bridge. Uh, and then prophet said to me that, pray this, that I will never born this baby by Caesar. I'm not born by Caesar. Jesus is not born by Caesar. He said that, and I do that every day. Amen and amen. Sister, when the doctor said you had a bridge presentation, do people that have similar case deliver safely without oppression? Uh, if you have bridge, you can't deliver a baby normally because it's a bridge. Uh, but... 
on cross overnight prophet he prayed for me and then the baby was turning in my stomach let us clap for master jesus my sister today to the glory of god the words of the servant of god has come to pass in your life did you deliver your baby safely without any cesarean operation? Yes, I delivered my baby. Let us clap for Jesus. Can we watch the clip when the servant of God, prophet, prayed for you? And let us see the feelings when the baby okay, turned. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Check out. Check out. It's 2024. <laughs> she she has contractions. Contraction, but the baby has not engaged. Yet. No, the baby never turned. The baby never turned. Yeah. The baby is standing like this. He's halfway. Check. He's halfway. Yes. He's halfway. Yes, my <laughs> The head has not engaged. The head never bent. Yeah. He never turned. He's halfway. Huh? To ten. You must turn. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Lord. Watch, look at, look at the baby. Look at the baby. Look at the baby. Look at the baby. Look, 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 look. Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? She's fine already. <laughs> what did she say? No, the baby's fine. Few days. Let us clap for Master Jesus. <laughs> sister, sister, when the, when the servant of God is praying for you, how did you feel? I was feeling like I'm in the labor pain. But I didn't feel nothing. I didn't hear even myself. What's going on? 
And then by the next week of the day, I went to the doctor. He told me that your baby, she's not breached. Now she's, well. Let us clap for Master Jesus. And today, to the glory of God, the NJ that is turning in your stomach, your womb, is the one you are carrying. Can we see her face? Let us see her face. You see her smiling. <laughs> amen and amen. Children of God, a prophet is he who prophesy and be alive and see all his prophecies come to pass. On that fateful day, the servant of God declared, 2024, you will hear, nye, nye. and to the glory of God, today we have had, nye, nye. and that nye, nye is with us today, worshiping and glorifying God. Let us put our hands together for Master Jesus. Sister, we join you and millions of viewers all over the world to praise God and worship him and glorify him for this wonderful miracle he has done for you. As a matter of fact, there are millions of people who are pregnant watching you through Rafa TV, through our Facebook and other media, social media channels. What is a word of advice to those facing the similar problem you faced initially last year, like the issue of bridge presentation? What is a word of advice to them so that you encourage them to come to Jesus Christ to have their freedom? The word of my advice is that stay in the Lord. And when you are in this house, don't go anywhere. Just stay in this house. There's a powerful anointing in this house. Amen. Amen, amen and amen. My sister, we thank you so wonderfully for this glorious testimony and we welcome our newest addition to the family of Shekana Glory of Faith Ministry. Before this time next year, possibly by the grace of God, you come back again with twins in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let us put our hands together for Master Jesus.